Good morning, guys. K.357 coming to you here. Today is, um, let me think here, Thursday, September the 20th. So um, we're putting our store back together. We've got some new showcases in here. So it's, to me, it's a lot cleaner look, and we're still working on it. So we'll probably spend in most of the day today as well. Um, just getting everything back in place, but it's not going to impede uh, you in any way as far as coming in here to shop. <clears throat> You'll be able to tell kind of what we're doing, but hopefully, well, really we need to get finished today because tomorrow's Friday and Saturday. We're going into the weekend. But what I wanted to talk to you about this morning, just real quick, um, is some holsters, just some different holsters to fit uh, one of the most popular guns out there, the, the Glock 19. Um, this just happens to be the Glock 19 Generation 4, so I want to show you about one, two, three, five, about six, seven uh, holsters that are very popular for this gun. You know, and the thing is, you know, some people come in here sometimes and say, well, you know, I heard you're a Glock guy. You know, well, you know, being a police officer for 15 years, um, the majority of the guns that I used in my 15-year period were uh, Glocks. Um, you know, I know they run, I know they work, I know they're very reliable. Uh, I, I do think they're probably one of the best guns out there for the money as far as your biggest bang for the buck. Um, and I'm a big SIG fan as well. You know, when I went to work for uh, Pittsburgh Police Department, um, you know, my chief gave me a brand spanking new SIG P220 right out of the box. I shot 100 with it right out of the box. So needless to say, I was a big SIG fan. Never shot a SIG before in my life until then. and. Um, Instantly, you know, I fell in love with that gun as well. Uh, I know the SIGs are very high quality. I went to a Glock Armor School and a SIG Armor School. Um, the SIG Armor School, you know, there were twice as many parts in that SIG P220 as there was in the uh, in the Glock. Um, you know, where I worked at, we were running Glock 21s, uh, chambered in 45 ACP, and that SIG 220 was chambered in 45 ACP. He had about eight rounds in there versus 13 rounds in the uh, Glock 21. But anyway, I want to talk to you about holsters real quick. So the first one that I do want to show you would be an outside the waistband holster. This comes with either a paddle or a uh, belt that you can attach. This is the Blackhawk Serpa holster. Uh, back there on the back behind it, there's where you attach either the belt, the attachment for the belt, or the attachment for the uh, paddle. I love these because they're great. Uh, great. I mean, actually, you can wear these for concealment as well. Um, you know, I wear a lot of sweatshirts in the wintertime, you know, and this will just pull right over that. But what I like about it, obviously, great retention there. You have to push this button to get the gun out, but it's on the, the natural draw. You just place your finger there, depress it, and the gun comes right out. But if this, if this holster's on me, this, which is typically what I wear if you come in the store, um, you're not going to get this gun out of the holster unless you press the button, but you're going to pull me off the ground first before you get this gun out of the holster. It ain't coming out unless you press the button. That is the Serpa, Blackhawk Serpa holster that we have for $49.99. All right, let me take this out. Let's go to the next one. Concealment Express. Um, and by the way, most all your packaging for holsters is where you can take the holster out. We encourage you to do that, to take it out and try it out. So this will be an inside the waistband holster, very sturdy, a, a very, very heavy duty clip there. Um, fits in, Kydex, fits right there in the gun. Great retention. You know, I like retention because, you know, if you have to deal with a bad guy and, and things get kind of physical for, for a moment or two there, um, you know, you get knocked down, the gun's not gonna pop out of your holster. We don't want that to happen that way. Perhaps the bad guy or somebody else gets hold of the gun, they don't have any business with it. But um, these Concealment Express holsters are very nice as well. Kydex, we got these for $34.99. So, well, I'm just going to let that drop right there because I sure ain't going to start this video over again. Then we have the 1836 Texas Series. Um, this is also by Tagua, which we sell lots of Tagua holsters. Um, let me tell you a little bit about this one. Really neat. It's got a couple of good features there. Leather, all right, can be worn inside the waistband, or we can take these off and you can run it sort of like as a pancake holster and run your belt through these loops right here. So I love the way this works, works in two ways, inside the waistband or outside the waistband. 
these tag wheel holsters are such good quality. The stitching, double stitching is really nice. Um, fits the gun like a glove. So there you go, you got your leather, uh, all leather, which is, to me, these holsters are very comparable to the Bianchi's and the Galco's, which are quite a bit more money, but we got these at $45.99, which is obviously a great price. You put this holster in your hand, this thing speaks nothing but quality. And uh, so check that one out. All right, moving over here, we got another tag wheel holster. This is called the, the four into one. Um, this is really neat too. We sell a lot of these. These are $41.99, and the four into one means there's four different ways that you can ca carry this thing. Okay, so gun fits in here, of course. You can carry this as an inside the waistband. You can carry it, run your belt through here, and carry it as an outside the waistband. You can also carry it as a cross draw. You got various slots here. You can carry it as a cross draw or inside the small of your back as well. So uh, this fits the gun also very well. Get it in there, kind of show you what I'm talking about. Um, very nice there. Of course, you know how it is with the leather. You know, the, the longer you have it, it's going to get a little bit more supple and it's going to mold even better to the gun. Um, I love good quality leather holster. So we got that at $41.99. And then this one here is an extremely popular one. This is our sticky holster, probably our best selling holster for folks that like to carry inside the waistband. Sticky, the reason they call it sticky is because if you feel of the material, it adheres uh, to the inner waistband of your pants and basically when you draw it the gun's going to come out the holster is going to stay in your waistband or it can also be worn all right wrong size for that glock but it also can be worn uh, as a pocket holster as well and ladies a lot of ladies love this because you know a lot of times you'll carry in your pocketbook or purse and so this does two things it protects the finish of the gun of course and it also mainly protects the trigger guard you know, that's one of the main things for the holster is not just to protect the gun, but to protect that trigger guard to keep your finger from getting in there and causing a negligent discharge. So sticky holsters, we got these at $27.99. Um, I can thank Trooper Black here in uh, Lee County for, which I think he's on the governor, back on the governor's detail now, for uh, suggesting those. When we first opened up, he said, man, you need to try these sticky holsters out. These are really neat. I think he might have been carrying a SIG P238 in it. But um, he was right. Uh, once we put them in the store, they ended up being one of our best-selling holsters. I got two more left. I got another one. This is also um, made by Tagua. This is called the Recruiter, and but this is, they've got it under the name uh, Armament. All right. This is an inside the waistband holster, as well. This one is $45.99, and so your Glock 19 would go right in here. Just perfect, fits in there nice and easy. It's got a nice uh, leather backing there to provide comfort. Of course, it's got your clips there as well. And these will sort of, you know, these obviously can be adjusted with ease um, and you can wear this inside your waistband. I mean, you know, we've taught about 14,000 students in concealed carry and by far inside the waistband is the most popular. It's not really the most popular for me. I think being a cop, you know, carrying outside the waistband so much um, that's kind of still the way I carry, you know, and like I said, in the, in the wintertime, you know, I will, um, you know, just put a, tea, uh, a sweatshirt over it and conceal it that way, and it conceals pretty nicely. The last one I'm going to show you is a uh, Galco. Any of you know when you've been around holsters and things like that very long, you know how uh, good quality Galco is and also Bianchi. I don't have a Bianchi here to show you, but I got this Galco. So this is also an inside the waistband as well. Real nice, high-quality leather back in there. And and the gun is sort of, um, you know, at a little bit of a cant there. This is called the King Tuck. The King Tuck, this is $62.99. Like I say, it's going to spend a few extra dollars for the Galco, but you get top-quality leather, stitching, backing, the Kydex right here, the gun that fits the holster perfectly. Um, these are just, you can just handle these and see what I'm talking about as far as the high quality goes. It'll probably last you a lifetime. All right, fits that Glock 19 perfectly. So I showed you about six or seven holsters there. Um, I mean, the thing is, most people that buy guns, um, you know, usually they'll have maybe three to five different holsters just depending on how they're going to carry that day or what they're going to wear. You know, one of our niches, we've only been open about five years, but one of our niches is, is I would like to, um, 
You know, it's going to take a while to get a bunch of guns in here. You know, we've only been open five years, but um, we're working really hard to have the best holster selection around. Um, the next line we're going to bring in is Alien Gear. But I want to have the, the very best holster selection around and the very best ammo selection as far as the different calibers, the hard to find calibers and things like that. Um, you know, I was just telling somebody yesterday, I, put, uh, I took apart and thoroughly cleaned a, um, a Lee Enfield uh, 1917 number one rifle Mark III uh, that Chambers British 303. I ordered three boxes, one kind of sort of for me because, honey, what are you looking at? I'm just waiting. Oh, she's just waiting for me because we're ready to move some more showcases around so i've got to in this video right about here but anyway <clears throat> i had a guy coming in he was looking all over the ammo and i finally said is there a particular caliber you're looking for and i hadn't even checked this 303 in yet and uh, he said yeah i'm actually looking for british 303 so as they say the lord works in mysterious ways so and he was looking for two boxes i had two boxes for him okay because he just came from Walmart, and he says, yeah, you ain't going to find stuff like this in Walmart. And he's right. You're not going to find British 303 in Walmart. You know, I know they got the popular calibers, the 9mm, full metal jacket, and all that. But that's the thing. We want to have some of the harder-to-find calibers that you can find right out here at our store, which is located at 1606 Westover Drive, Sanford, NC, 27330. Our phone number, and we still are having some problems with our phone lines. Just keep trying it eventually. Yeah, Laura says keep trying and it'll eventually go through. But if you need to contact me right away, you can send me an email at kevin at carolinafirearmstraining.com. But our phone number is area code 919-708-5475. And also, uh, don't forget this Saturday, concealed carry, 49 bucks. You can share this video, of course. And we also have an advanced AR-15 class that uh, Chris Walker's teaching. So we'll be teaching two classes that day, one in Moore County and one in Chatham County. Uh, you can sign up for these classes by going to carolinafirearmstraining.com. All right, I got to stop. So, so I'll see you next time. Stay armed and stay safe.